is an incredibly beautiful country. We've seen snow-capped volcanoes, gorgeous waterfalls, lovely cities, as well as amazing rainforests. I'm here to interview farmers who are growing naranjilla, a fruit that is used to make juice, um, about some of the work that they've been doing with INIAP and with the IPM Innovation Lab to better control pests and disease that the plant is vulnerable to. So the naranjilla plant produces fruit that is used to make juice. That's very common in Ecuador. Ecuador does juice really well with all sorts of um, tropical fruits. And naranjilla is important culturally. The naranjilla is also a very important crop for a lot of farmers because it produces much needed income. So one of the main issues that we've learned about from farmers is fusarium. It's a fungus that grows in the soil and builds up and it makes it to where they cannot continue to use the same land over and over again. The main issue with this is, is that as they cannot use the same land, they start cutting down more and more trees to increase farmland. Deforestation is becoming a huge issue in Ecuador. Everywhere you look, mountains are being cleared for increased agricultural production land. We're helping to reduce this need through best management practices. Our main goal is to help farmers, one, be able to provide for their families better, two, to produce better quality fruits and vegetables for markets, and three, to help stop deforestation to preserve this beautiful country. We met one farmer today who was out harvesting hay and he took a break to talk to us. He grows a variety of crops, one of them being naranjilla. He previously was growing the hybrid variety of naranjilla, but since working with INIAP technicians has started using the grafted variety. And this has allowed him to bring in much more income because the grafted variety lasts longer and can be replanted on the same land. And he also expressed how the cost of inputs was lower because he didn't have to apply as much agricultural chemicals to the crops in order to fight off insects and disease. I'm really excited to be a part of this project because I do consider it to be really important. Um, improving the management of naranjilla crops is critical in order to avoid further deforestation of this beautiful landscape, improve the health of farmers who are applying pesticides and herbicides, as well as improve the livelihoods of the farmers who are producing the naranjilla. For a while, I've learned about international agricultural development from the perspective of a desk. I've read a lot of articles and learned a lot that way, but it's so much more exciting to see it firsthand in person. I've learned so much on this trip. I can't even express how much more in depth it is to learn firsthand rather than from a textbook or from an article. Over the past two weeks, we've fallen in love with the people and the country of Ecuador. We hope that our research will help make a difference, however small, in helping to improve the quality of life for the people of Ecuador, as well as save this beautiful country.